Hey, what's going on everyone? In this video, I'm going to show you how you can watch multiple different versions of Netflix with Surfshark. So I'm going to dive straight in and as you can see, I'm open on Netflix and I have Surfshark installed onto my computer. So to get started, it's really, really simple guys. Essentially, all you have to do is search for a location that you would like to connect to. Um, so I'm kind of in the mood for watching the TV show Friends, which actually still can be found on Netflix. So I'll go and search for the United Kingdom. So I'll just do a quick search for that one. And as you can see guys, we've got a couple of different locations that I can connect to. So I'm just going to click on the top one and this will now go and connect me to the fastest server. And if you guys do want to follow along with this video, I actually do have a massive 83% discount link down below in the video description. So now that we are connected, this is highlighted in blue. So I can go back to my Netflix account and I'll refresh the browser and this will go and load me onto the UK based uh, version of Netflix. So I'll just give this a couple of moments to load. So now I'm here, I'll be able to search for the TV show Friends. So I'll just do a quick search for that one. And this is really one of the beauties of using a VPN guys. It is really simple to unblock the different versions of Netflix. And as you can see, we've got the Friends TV show, plus some additional titles uh, such as How I Met Your Mother, The Vampire Diaries, uh, The Big Bang Theory, and heaps more. So I'm just going to go uh, play a little bit of this uh, so you guys can get a real world indication for speeds. And that pretty much loaded instantly. So the next location I'm going to connect to is the United States. So I'll just backspace on this one and I'll go and search for the United States. And similar here guys, we have many locations we can connect to. So I'm just going to click on the top one. And this will go and disconnect me from the UK and then go and connect me to the United States. And it really is that simple guys. It only takes a couple of clicks to um, swap between locations. So now that we've done that, I'll go back to Netflix and I'll go back to the homepage. Okay guys, so now that we've refreshed the page, we'll now be on the American version of the platform. And just to show you guys this, I'll search for Marvel movies. And you actually still can find a couple of Marvel titles on uh, Netflix as long as you know where to look, even with the introduction of Disney+. Plus. And as you can see guys, we've got a couple of Marvel titles um, such as Avengers Infinity War, Ant-Man and the Wasp, and we also have some other titles uh, such as Solo, uh, Spider-Man, Ghost Rider, The Matrix, and the list pretty much keeps going on. So again, I'm going to go play a really small snippet of one of these movies in real time to again show you the speeds and performance of using Surfshark um, for connecting to various uh, locations. So for the US, I do find it typically takes between um, you know three and maybe 20 seconds on the long end of the spectrum to get connected. And this can also depend on where you're located in the world, how many people are on the server, and also the time of day you're trying to connect. But as you can see guys, that's now working with no issues. So as you can see from these various tests guys, uh, Surfshark really is a great contender for unblocking the different versions of Netflix. And you can even go and follow this same process on iPhone and Android devices. So again, guys, if you are looking to get started with Surfshark and Unblocked Netflix, then don't forget to check out the massive 83% discount link down below in the video description. So hopefully this video on how to watch Netflix with Surfshark has been helpful for you. Um, if I've missed anything out or maybe you have a question, then feel free to comment down below and I'll be more than happy to help you guys out. So as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the next one.